Hello and welcome back to another episode of Lamplighter's League. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the Lamplighter's League playthrough, blind playthrough, I shall say. We're in um, week number 21. Main team got a bit of a setback. Ingrid, uh, three weeks of problems. Eddie, three weeks of problems, which forces us to... Uh, take a couple of unproven resources and uh, do the Crossroads Archive heist setup with a few different agents. Uh, this time, instead of Eddie, we're taking in uh, Celestine. She's going to be our melee. And uh, we're taking a sniper, Purnima, with us. Not sure if this team will have enough um, power to just uh, rush through the uh, mission, specifically kind of damage. Might be a bit problematic, uh, but we're going to see. More ammo, not a bad idea for her, because when she reloads, things are not going well, but the crit chance actually isn't bad either. Upon suffering a stress break, no, we don't want that. Killing an enemy heals stress. And self buff being healed increases armor by three. Eh. Eh. We've seen better, uh, better items before we go into the mission. We can't get any, any other this? items. All of this here costs ether and king ether. So, well, that's unfortunate. Uh, weapon gains a 25% chance for blinded. Does Celestine have a good crit option? It's plus one additional stress, stress damage upon landing a crit. So, maybe we're just switching it around, right? So, we got blinded. On hit and we got the extra crit chance here I wonder with her with Anna Sophie I mean the 10% extra hit chance are really really good if she theoretically had something like a blinding on top uh, of what she uh, she is doing that wouldn't be too bad, would it? Yeah, but maybe we're doing that at, in a, at a different time. I'm still trying to figure out uh, what the right setup for the agents is. Uh, Anna Sophie then could be a crowd controller. We're currently not having the right, uh, really, a lot of crowd control. We're working with this team um, and are trying to infuse stress breaks. But unfortunately, she's the only agent uh, that really works with stress. I would be hoping that we're finding other agents, but apparently, so far, uh, no further agents showed up. This is the place. All right, we landed. Let's see how good the team is going to perform. Only Anna Sophie is upgraded; the other two are not. It is very drab in here and gray uh, that is I think the room that we want to go into everything has a use an ether very good another ether well, I shouldn't say very good because uh, realistically these things are only good if we get king ethers. Now found. There's a bit of a medical kit. And stress remedy. Hmm. I would say Celestine could use it. 
But we haven't even had a single fight so far. And what do we have here? Okay, we're kitted out. Now let's not be stupid. But try to hit these guys one by one. Celestina is going to start. A true strike. There are more to slay. Quickly now. All right, not bad. Not bad at all. <laughs> nah, we can't really get very close to him. He needs to first of all calm, calm a little bit down. Dream your dreams. There we go. Good. Let's get a few more of these guys. It's interesting that a sniper Got this one. is a melee assassin. <laughs> Let's not get caught out. That would really suck. There is a triplet pack of melee contestants running around. Can't get close to them, but we can get close to them. Specifically if they separate. Not great. Good. Move, move, move. Just far enough away from them. One, Keep two. Like this and the noble houses will be ruins in no time. Moves to here. You know what? The person that really needs Quicker the movement speed is our healer. She moves up and our sniper. Moves into a decent cover position. Good. Let's see what the enemy's got. Melee. Melee. More melee. And melee. That's a mistake, my friends. You shouldn't have brought that much melee. A fatal flaw revealed. Yep. A fatal flaw revealed is a very fitting description. Okay. Together now. 
Walks up. <laughs> Good. If nothing else helps, let's mesmerize you and put a curse on you. Deepen, so to the light. I'm hoping for um, stress break. Done. Nice little knockdown. Stress break is almost there. We're getting some stress ourselves. That's not great. If they are coming from here, let's move up. And we're putting some evasion up to tank the first hit. In the meantime, cooldown reduction. And some nice little damage over there. Cool. You and you get an extra round. Wonderful. And uh, <laughs> cold gambiting. Very good. We're blessing again, that will reset her cooldown, uh, cooldowns. Which puts another curse right on here. And that's the stress break we were looking for. Very good. Kill. Very nice. That's another kill. There we go. Reload. And Celestine will take a bit of damage, one hit to be precise, but Look, we're keeping them busy. Never mind, she will not be the one taking damage. Moves to here. Finisher gives her her mesmerize ability back. Right between the third and fourth thoracic. Fantastic hit. Ha! Did you see that? Come 
Come on, chaps. Okay, we're done with this room. We did reasonably well. And it might be a blessing in disguise. Who knows what else is up there. Pardon me. I'm good. I'm good. Carry on. Taking a stress remedy. By the way, can you throw this? No, you need to give it to someone. Okay. Push Good on. to know. More ether. Another stress remedy, okay. for doing what must be done. Well, that's that then. Okay, easy enough. We go. Got some intel. A missing card. Got a nice little moat. That's fantastic. Better that I hold on to this. And another stress flask. Hmm. I think we're dropping the stress remedy and we're instead taking a stress yes. flask because we want to overload the guys with stress. So stress flasks are actually quote unquote heaven sent because That'll help us to get more breakthroughs, etc, etc. This will get their attention. Good. We got two more charges to do anything. Another stress remedy. Why are there so many stress remedies? Is there a particular type of enemy here that's just dealing ultra high amounts of stress? This will be of use. Very strange. Martel's crossroads beacons. Oh wow. I'd imagine his travel logs are nearby. Can we get up here? No. High ground would be nice, wouldn't it? Tovis somehow tamed the dead. Shades, who channel the spiritual pollution called Void. Beware their wails of anguish and the remnants they leave behind. Okay. That honesty does not sound too pleasant. Couldn't really get out of there. 
Oh, these guys are having evasion. Okay, oh, I see. I want to get this guy. Time for a gambit. I will face my fate. Nope, that's just stress. Move to here, and we're starting with uh, taking you Hush. over. Forget your fears for now. More damage on you. Fair enough. We can do it. Everybody becomes inspired. That would be double hit, but not a triple. That would be a triple hit. Hmm. Okay, we'll do that in a second. Kill. Fabulous. So, you want to see what I can really do? And now seems to be an appropriate time to hit all of uh, these guys. More and more health. Fantastic. Putting a curse on you. Yeah, take your friend over there. Good job. What? I hate to bother you, but I'm rather dying. Don't leave us yet. Your story doesn't end here. Heal. Now imagine how much more difficult this would be without a skilled medic, eh? You have been sent to help me. Heal and de-stress to be precise.
could move a little bit back. Question is, is that worth our time and effort? Or should we go for the melee guy there? I want to stress break uh, some of them. That's two on each. For starters, we're getting an extra AP. That's good. Let's hope they're not targeting you are in danger. this explosive there. Good. More stress. Thank you. Now. That's a big fat stress flask. I hope that's not a ghost. I might have to rethink my profession. There's a stress break I was looking for. Move up. Free stress kill and good cover position. Get our signature charge back. Uh, we are taking you. Free you from the burden of choice. Fatal flaw revealed. Good, more damage against that one because we're in melee, unfortunately. Even if it kills me, especially if it kills me. Oh. Okay, let's try to kill this. Oh, come on. At least he's blinded. We were surprisingly unlucky this turn. Oh, come on, really? Two hits, although he's blinded, two double hits. Some of this guy is still not uh, broken with his stress. Rejoice, you edge closer to the great adventure. That's a problem, the overwatch here.
This will finally break him. Good. That gives AP back, reduces stress, and I need to get back to motivate, which we can do. By further reducing our cooldowns. We do that with a reload, automatic cooldown reduction. That will do this and that. Still trying to go for this side. Okay, here we finally get our signature charge back. Let your mind go blank. Listen there you go, mesmerize you. to have everybody in there. Reload, and we need to deal. Ah, uh, that's not killing him. Keep the signature charge. That could be a kill. My hands and eyes, so no bother. Unfortunate. Are you a student of death or merely a fool? Are you worried about me? Oh, I love that. Enemies are trying their best to get each other's evasion. Not so fast, Jack. Not today. And more enemies, of course. Good, let's get that skeleton, finally. Cooldowns are good. Together now. Cleansing. We're a bit too exposed for my taste, so we're moving to here. Heal up, regain action point. Not going to lose anyone. Because of really caregiver. Embarrassing, isn't this? It is the only way. Yeah, 
Good, we need AP. We're getting stress instead. Fantastic. A few guys could be blinded. That's fine. And marked. Cool. I need to keep on going because I need my signature ability back. Good. Signature charge back. We will get uh, toasted if we're staying here. No, no. I think we'll continue to take you. Nice little mesmerize. And... We're almost... Almost done. Cooldowns reloaded. You and you take you an extra turn. Might as well just passively use evasion in this case. We're going for their snipers. And we're reloading. Not bad. Go and shoot him instead of us. Look at you, it's follow oh, okay. Didn't know that. Didn't know that. to here I'm getting good at this 
Good hit. Condo code game, but um, we can't, we just can't. Moves to here and evade. That's unfortunate. Celestina is really high highs, but on uh, sometimes just incredibly poor turns. Well, she's not fast enough to move in. Give me a target. Get up. Get up. You don't leave things unfinished. Get up. Bollocks. This isn't looking good. Moves to here. Once again. A little turmeric, limestone powder, and a competently applied bandage will fix this. Once again, you have been sent to help me. Can't do anything here. Let me help. We can cleanse them. All right. Need to finish this one here. A grenade would be perfect. Unfortunately, that's not how it works. Snapshot is just really poor chances of hitting anything. Find another fox. There we go, one down. Stress. Who needs stress? I can already see you over here could use some stress. Dread. That's one into. I need to gambit. Let the cards fall as they may. Very good. Moves in. This finally breaks so the ghost. A longer. We take you over. Let me in. Heal ourselves. And I think we're just self evading here. That'll give us still a bit of electricity damage. But overall, we should be fine. It's that. 
Wow, minus five cooldowns. Okay, cool. Go and hit this guy. You know you want it. Well, they decide to not hit him, which I think is pretty pathetic. I was expecting more. Your weakness is obvious. All right. Kill this guy. Fantastic. Here. Cleanse, cleanse, and you guys get extra you know turns. Do. do it. Yeah, we need to use this turn for reload. Unfortunate. Your time has come. I hope you stay on our side. Good. Even if we're getting fired, burned, <laughs> things are still okay. fire cleanse that and how about we're self evading that's a good start move over here reload and I want a hundred percent chance to hit him Care so lock him shot. down <laughs> Not. Okay, well, learn something. Evasion really doesn't do anything about burning. Less we are more than this fight. cleanses, which is great, and we take forty percent more damage, please. Revealed. Come on. Unbelievable. This guy is still standing. Divine light, give me strength. Thankfully, yeah, push us back. 
Good, now we're dazed and we lost the rest of our action. That's, by the way, also a very nasty mechanic. Yes! Well, this will be over soon. Good, that doesn't matter. Curse him. It's almost at the stress breaking point. I think this guy can be solidly ignored if you are not. standing next to him specifically since he's exploding right so really no one wants that okay done wow well Let's drop that. Um, we're picking this up. And Let me help you. That's a full heal. In my line of work. All right, let's go. Now. We're very much out of juice. Uh, I think we need to gather a couple of the other items here. If I'm not mistaken, we at least had a few stress remedies here and there. Remain here. I like that you really need to use your consumables a lot. There are plenty available, but you are very much encouraged to use them. As most of them... This will serve. As most of them are important. The hour has not yet come. The one thing that I will say is... If you need healing, then you've typically done something wrong. And I wonder what that was. Maybe my uh, team composition. I don't know. So maybe it's because all of them are not upgraded. And we're fighting relatively tough battles. Well, enemy re is upgraded, but then again, psyching that shouldn't really be an excuse. If you play it well, then you should be able to crowd control. The Celestine uh, thing, I believe if she's upgraded a little bit more, you can get her chain going, right? With getting cooldown uh, reductions, reducing her stress, and then her occult gambit becomes less of a liability, really. Many transmat locks. Take them all. Mr. Lock will be able to find the right one. Well, this is going to be noisy. Okay. I can use this. Uh, more ether, more lore. Actually, I was hoping for a few more healing items.
can't kill these guys, not with a normal takedown. There is the exit. Uh, this very much looks like yet another room where things are going to spawn. So, since we're pretty much out of everything, I am going to select to just get out of here. Good. There wasn't an optional objective or anything. It falls to lock now to comb these locks for the Persephonite's location. Good. Plenty of skill points gained. Let's see what the cards are. The gambler, the archer and the monument. The gambler. After dodging an attack, Agent becomes inspired and recovers 5 health. That's not bad. Uh, the Archer, buff ability target teammates next attack will hit and deal critical damage. Alright, I know that that will be definitely Some yours. I will not forgive. And the monument debuff ability to stress on surrounding enemies uh, that Threats sounds like something you would want to do who knows the old words this will give us an edge fantastic so we set up a heist well well We located the next tower, which I think is good. And we got more skill points. What did you find out there? Cool. I need to unfortunately head out because I do have another appointment, uh, but I think this is a good cliffhanger for the next time. Haven't reached any Agents, major breakpoints. The transmat logs you stole from Marto's archives have revealed the location of his person. Good. But next time we can spend the skill points and see what our setup for the next mission will be. Um, so far, the triple ladies have done well. But I think that Celestine, uh, I need to think about how to use her. She's doing so well sometimes, but then from time to time she's not doing well. So we'll need to figure that out. Thanks for watching, guys. See you later and have a great day. Bye-bye.